sometimes you may want to remove the background of an image and this is a short simple technique actually a few different ways to do that go ahead and make a selection of something that you want to cut out I just used the quick selection tool here and on certain parts where the hue was too similar to the area around it like on top of the helmet there I had to hold down shift and use the polygonal lasso tool to add a little bit to that also hold down alt or option on the Mac alt on the PC and use one of the other tools and you can subtract from the selection too I'm not going to go too into too much detail with selections that's in other tutorials but make just a basic selection around something you want to cut out you can go to select and then refine edge or modify if you have an older version you just go to refine edge if you want to feather it like I'm going to just do 0.2 pixels for this example and hit OK. And here's a couple ways to do this. The first step is actually to double click on the background layer or click and drag that lock to the trash. That will make it a normal layer that we can delete pixels from and it'll show through the transparent area. So what you can do if you press Control J, that will duplicate whatever's selected on its own layer. You hit the eye icon of the bottom layer, the original layer, and then you can see we have our uh, content here that we had selected. Another way is to actually go to select and then inverse and now we have everything but the individual selected and just press backspace on PC or delete on the Mac and that will delete all the pixels around them. I'm just doing control alt Z to undo or step backward. Uh, you can do the same thing on the Mac command option um, Z third way to do this whatever we have selected we want everything else to be cut out you can just click the mask down here layer mask and it'll actually add a mask to that layer so that's three different ways this masking out everything you can alt click it option click the mask and see what areas actually masked out and with the mask you can actually paint some black on or paint some white if you think it was cut out certain areas let me show you what I mean if I'll paint some white on here it'll start to bring back the content see of the original layer so that's a couple different ways to do that finally a third way you can well go to edit copy or you can just go to the move tool and click and drag it over to another image if you want to use it on top of another background like so so that's a couple different ways of removing a background in Photoshop thanks